Hey guys, so Quip Toothbrush just released their newest product, which is dental floss. So in this video, I'm going to be telling you a little bit about this floss and if I think it's worth buying. So this is probably the most expensive floss that I've ever purchased. It is $20 for this metal version and $10 for a plastic version. And if you buy it as a standalone item, they tack along $10 in shipping. Um, however, if you purchase it as a subscription, which you can tag on to your normal Quip tooth toothbrush subscription, uh, then they charge you no shipping. And then the refills are $5, which come every three months. And basically the floss just looks like this. It looks like this metal canister that says Quip on it. And basically how the design works is there's this little, um, top section that you press down on and this little floss section comes out. And beyond that, really the only thing that's unique about it is they have these markings on it. So every 18 inches, there's a little green spot in the floss and that is meant to be a marking for where you cut it off. So I'll show you how big that is here. So this is how big the each section a floss is supposed to be. And they have green markings on it, basically just to show you how much you should be using in a day. Other than that, the floss itself is pretty normal. It is a subtle mint flavor. It is a waxed nylon vegan formula. I have no complaints about it. It's pretty normal floss. I, it did not shred in my teeth or anything like that. No real complaints as far as the actual product of the floss itself. So that's basically what you can expect for this initial floss. Basically how it works then with the refills is they, they pop out like this. It's almost like a little like tampon thing that like hangs on to the floss here and then it goes in this canister and so this is what you're going to be getting as a refill every three months and it says this end up and kind of what's cool about this is that you do save on the plastic so this is just made out of metal there's probably some little plastic in here but the refills don't really have any plastic so you do save on some waste on an ongoing basis. Now, one thing to note, when I first saw this floss on the advertisements, I thought that this was Quip's version of one of those like floss picks. And so when I first bought it, I saw this thing and I was like, oh, I'm supposed to stick this like entire thing in my mouth and like use it as a floss pick but it does not work like that. It completely does not hold enough tension to do that. It will just like, cave in on itself if you try to use it as a floss pick. So just a warning to you, if you think that is what you're buying, it's not. So is this floss worth buying? So I would say if number one, you already have a Quip toothbrush subscription and you're just tagging this along and number two, you just want something that's cute, that is, you know, a sleek, elegant floss design and number three, it's not a big deal to you to spend 10 to $20 for literally a thing of dental floss, then I would say go ahead and buy it. Um, I will continue to use it. I think it's perfectly good floss. That being said, if you are buying this because you are expecting some sort of like revolutionary new floss and you are expecting something different than you can walk into Walgreens and buy right now that you are going to be sorely disappointed because basically all this is is just a fancy canister for dental floss. I would say if you don't have a Quip subscription already, I probably would not get one just to get this floss. I think it's a good add-on, but probably not worth it as a standalone product. Let me know your thoughts. Are you going to be purchasing this floss? Let me know. And that's it. Bye guys.